645 million dollars, 372 feet, five decks, and 100% pure hydrogen power. Say hello to Bill Gates' new mega yacht, the Aqua. For those of you guys who didn't attend the Monaco Yacht Show earlier this year, well, you missed out on luxury ships worth up to $4.5 billion in Port Hercules and perfectly dressed people sipping champagne as they strolled from mega boat to mega boat. But every visitor couldn't stop talking about one particular vessel belonging to a special someone. This $644 million hydrogen powered mega yacht that was allegedly already commissioned by the one and only Bill Gates. With a length of 372 feet, the Aqua is certainly big, although not the biggest yacht in the world. But when it is completed in 2024, it will be the world's first hydrogen powered yacht. The details on this boat are insane, not to mention how the boat operates. So here's why it's well worth such a premium price. Back at the Monaco Yacht Show, the creative brains behind the Aqua released full drawings for the yacht. Now, hydrogen power may sound like some superpower used by comic heroes against mega villains, but it's actually a real science project with surprising benefits you won't believe. Even Elon Musk, who was once a big skeptic, recently shocked Twitter followers when he announced that he too will be switching Tesla from batteries to hydrogen power in 2024. So there's definitely something to this hydrogen power thing. And Bill Gates seems to be ahead of the curve on this one. And as you might have guessed by now, hydrogen power is 100% environmentally friendly, whereas most boats still use oil. Ugh. In 2019, the world's super yachts consumed an estimated 32 million gallons of oil and emitted 627 million pounds of carbon dioxide. Meanwhile, hydrogen fuel cells use a chemical reaction between hydrogen and oxygen to produce fuel. This highly pressured hydrogen is held on the aqua in two 28-ton vacuum sealed tanks that have been frozen to a temperature of minus 423 degrees Fahrenheit, which is, by the way, colder than the ground on Pluto. In short, this mega yacht can sail 3,750 nautical miles without ever needing to refuel. On top of that, it takes just a couple of minutes to recharge this mega boat's tank back to 100%. That's way faster than most electric cars which need between 6 and 12 hours of charge time. We're looking at you, Tesla. Now all that green energy sounds exciting, but it's really the boat's gorgeous design that got everyone so excited. Have you ever seen a ship like this traveling through the Caribbean or docked in a luxurious harbor? Maybe in Guardians of the Galaxy, but not in real life. With its elegant curving lines and a free-flowing shape, this ship's exterior was designed to resemble ocean waves. Add to that its chrome-colored coating and the boat blends in just perfectly with the sea. And that glassy sitting space you see in front of the bow is actually a part of the owner's pavilion. Yes, you heard that right, the owner doesn't just get a bed or a room on board this ship, they get a whole pavilion. That's basically like having your own apartment on a ship that's separate from the rest of the ship. No, seriously, the pavilion occupies the front half of the top level of the boat and is possibly the most remarkable component of the ship. The owner's pavilion is a private, open concept room where the yacht's owner may relax and thrive. This area is split into multiple sections by wooden panels that enable gently diffused light to pass through. The owner's pavilion as well as the rest of the boat is constructed in Japanese minimalist style. The primary spacious area, with its 12-foot ceilings and skylights, is meant to be filled with anything the owner chooses. Whether it's fine art, instruments, or weird objects, we all know what billionaires are like, right? Floor-to-ceiling windows line each of the owner's pavilion, creating a sensation of boundless openness when paired with the expanse of the sea. Inside the pavilion, there are many seating rooms, workstation areas, and nice spots to snuggle up a cup of tea. The main bedroom is likewise located here, and when I said simple, I meant minimalist. Warm wood accents a fluffy king-size bed, and that is about it for the bedroom. Any more minimalist than that and you'll be sleeping on an empty floor. The owner's bathroom is located next to the bedroom. The floor is covered in smooth, standard black marble, and it provides lovely symmetry around the jacuzzi tub in the middle of the room. I'll say it again, the jacuzzi tub is in the middle of the room. 
warm ambient lighting and lateral wood walls complete another lavishly designed room aboard this boat. Even with such a luxurious private pavilion, the owner of this boat does not need to worry about his guests feeling inferior. With four independent guest cabins and two VIP suites, the yacht may host another 14 passengers in total luxury. The VIP cabins include an expansive lounge area and king-size beds with the same pleasant beachy minimalist decor as the pavilion. The adjacent bathroom's zen aesthetic shows through as well, with circles on top, with contrasting white marble symbolic of those meticulously created in Japanese sand gardens. And yes, every one of the guest rooms has its personal patio and adjacent bathrooms. Even more intriguing is that each love on this ship has a huge circular lounge space in the middle with views of the ocean, giving a great gathering spot for guests after a long day at sea. On the main deck is also a pool that seems more like an art exhibit than just a spot to bathe your toes. The waterfall motif is attractive and complemented by lots of opportunities to sunbathe and relax. Yet another lounge space further down the deck features a sliding glass wall to enable the fresh ocean breeze to circulate freely. A magnificent grand staircase leads to the lower levels. The spiral steps are lit brilliantly, and there's a glass panel at the bottom that reveals the hydrogen tanks beneath, allowing guests to appreciate the true power of this boat. And a luxury boat wouldn't be complete without a state-of-the-art spa made of elegant circular shapes that convey a sense of peace across all the spaces. The hydro massage area features numerous rainfall showers for deep tissue massages, while the jacuzzi features a single waterfall element that is guaranteed to be calm and fascinating. A full-service gym is also adjacent to the spa with state-of-the-art equipment for visitors to use while watching the sunset over distant waters. Also on board is indeed a beauty salon where guests can get all glammed up for a fancy dinner. The beauty salon's decor strives to create a relaxing atmosphere. Anyone who walks through the door will be greeted by wood lattice walls with views of the ocean and sleek black ceilings that mirror the studio lights. Several more vehicles are also on board the Aqua. A customized Aqua helicopter stands on the helipad, allowing visitors to embark quickly and easily. Two tenders, three surf runners, and a variety of water toys like kayaks and inflatables are also available to take visitors on day outings. The Aqua is a beautiful boat, but who was the holder? Early rumors stated that Bill Gates was the fortunate bidder, however both senior executives have flatly disputed that story, reporting on their website that the yacht has yet to find a buyer. However, there's always a cause to care about rumors, and if not Bill Gates, it'll only be a matter of time until a billionaire who appreciates clean energy buys this boat. Elon, how about you? All right, if you were Bill Gates, are there any features you would like to add to make this yacht grander than it already is? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to like the video, subscribe to Mr. Exclusive, and we'll see you in the next one.